your boy, what's good? What up, it's your boy K Meach, we back, and today we got a new Pokemon trailer that just dropped. Now, before I even get into it, right, I know there's been a lot of Pokemon drama going around. I haven't even talked about this at all, because I ain't a PokeTuber, bro. I do mess with Pokemon, don't get it twisted, bro. Don't get it twisted. I mess with Pokemon, but yeah, the whole, the whole National Dex thing, let me just get it out the way now. For me, personally, I don't really care too much about it. For me, a new Pokemon game is all about the new Pokemon, bro. That's how I build my team, so it's not that big of an issue to me. I might get a lot of dislikes just for saying that, but I definitely understand why people are upset. And Masuda, dude, he came out and addressed it, bro. This man said nothing. Can we just be real? The reason I'm saying all that is because I just want to get it out the way now that I'm still hyped for this game personally. It's one of my most anticipated games coming out this year. Yeah, I'm excited for this. I'm excited to watch this. It's called Gigantamaxing Changes the Game and Po- Hold up. We changing the game out here? As a matter of fact, I think I remember hearing Gigantamaxing in a rumor a little while back. It said it was like kind of like Mega Evolutions, but I don't freaking know, bro. We about to find out. Gigantamaxing changing the game. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Hit me with a game freak. Okay, Pokemon Sword and Shield. We know it. Okay, we walking into this arena. We've seen this shot like a good five times. I'm not complaining. Who's that? Oh, that's a new Pokemon, Owl Cream. A little ice cream? Yeah, for my dude, bro. This man's got that wagon, bro. Pause, but what's well, it's a dog, but it's still a holy coley. I mean, it's still a pause, bro, but. Okay, he looks pretty cool. Oh! Holy crap, they're hitting us with mad Pokemon, bro. This man gets on all fours. Hey, that's my girl right there, bro. Who is that dude? Oh man, that dude. He reminds me of something. Olina? Who is that? Bay? B? Oh, is she a fighting type? Oh my god, that is a sick design. Is that a girl or a dude? I think it's a dude. Could be a girl though, but I like that freaking design. Okay, that's a little Dynamaxing going. Oh, is that... Yeah, that's just a normal Dynamax, it looks like. Here we go, Gigantamax. Change of size and appearance, okay. Oh my god! Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm gonna turn into a cake? Okay, that's Dreadnought, but he's standing on two feet. That's my dude, Corviknight. Oh. Holy mother of god, bro. Okay, Dreadnought's just a little weird. He kind of looks like Blastoise when he stands up on two feet, but this ice cream turns into a goddamn cake! Uh, okay, uh, I'm down. Y'all already know, bro, I was messing with Dynamaxing. Now we gig- what is it? Gigantamaxing? And you know, I liked Mega Evolutions, bro. I kind of wish they did more, right? Because obviously we know they came back in Sun and Moon, but there were no new ones in Sun and Moon. Now they're just gone completely, but I, I really liked- Mega Evolutions, but this looks like a kind of like it, right? It's kind of, oh, let's just be real. They're just Mega Evolutions, bro, but they made them big. That's really what it is. Let's just be honest with each other, with ourselves. These right here are Mega Evolutions, and I'm not complaining, bro. Like I said, Dreadnought, man, his Gigantamax is a little weak. Gigantamax, what was that new ice cream Pokemon? It turned into a cake, dog. Oh! I just noticed this. It's actually on top of the cake. So is it actually a cake or is it just standing on top of one? But it just looks like when it grows, bro, just is standing on the cake. I don't know, bro. That's wild. Because I thought it was ice cream. An ice cream cake? Hey, I'd be messing with that ice cream cake, though. You got the nice little cake and then you hit that ice cream. Oh, and can we talk about Corviknight real quick? This man spread his wings. His wings are looking like blades, bro, with that red. I don't know what it is, but them red shines. It sounds like when he opens his wings, it's just like, shing. Corviknight's Gigantamax is my favorite bow. He looks hard, dude. He's got that little cloud over his head. He looks like a member of the goddamn Akatsuki right now. Yo, if Atachi was a Pokemon trainer, this dude would be rolling deep with Corviknight's, bro. He'd be freaking strutting down the Leaf Village with a bunch of Corviknight's by his side. But yeah, Chairman Rose, he's pretty cool. Olina, she kind of bad, but you know I'm still messing with Nessa, bro. It, it, it's not even a contest. And then we got Bay here and her design, bro. Yo, the gym leader designs are looking clean in this game. We got Nessa, the water type. The girl. Now we got my girl Bay or B. I'm gonna call her Bay. Her design is crazy. And then we had freaking this 
guy or girl. I don't, I, I think it's a guy. Well, Alistair, man, that could go both ways, but that's a ghost type, bro. That is such a dope design. It looks like a shy guy, does he not? Or her not? This is my favorite gym leader design. I really like this design. And then yeah, that Gigantamaxing, I'm a fan of bro. Well, I'm a fan of Dynamaxing in general, but Gigantamaxing just adds to it. I like Mega Evolutions, I like Dynamaxing. They put those things into one and I freaking love it. Now, let's do it, man. Let's go to the comments, bro. What are people gonna be saying? Are they gonna be just talking about the national decks? Well, how many waifus are you going to put in this game? Game Freak, yes. What's going on with that, bro? Game Freak, what are you doing? Well, I'm calling it the chairman is the main evil dude. Dude, he do look a little, he do look a little suspect. And you know, man, them freaking CEOs, bro, you gotta watch out for him, dog. Oh my God, dude, I just realized something. I'm reading the comments here. I missed it in the trailer, but someone said, so B is specific to sword and Alistair is for shield. And I went back in the trailer. I missed it, but it showed the icons for sword would B. I'm gonna call her Bay, bro. I just feel like that's what it is. And then Shield for uh, Alistair. And that's not good, bro, because I like them both, dude. Why are you doing this to me, Game Freak? That's what you're trying to do. You're trying to make me buy both versions. You're trying to make me shell out the money. You don't got the national decks, but you want me to buy it twice, bro? Again, like I said, I don't care about the national decks, but come on, Game Freak. Are you serious, dog? Oh, man. Exclusivity. What are you going to do, man? You're you going to make me shell out the money. I'm not shelling out the money for a dang gym leader, bro. You're tripping, dog. You might be like, oh, dude, they're just gym leaders. Who cares? But they could have... I mean, clearly, they have two completely different personalities and they could, like, have some funny dialogue and they're- Shoot, have we even seen some voice boxes in this game? Or freaking voice boxes, text boxes? I don't think we still- I still don't think we have. So we could be having voice acting and what if they got different personalities, bro? One of them could end up being my favorite character, but if I only get one version, then I might not ever know. Either way, man, overall- I'm still hyped for this game, man. F the national decks, bro. I'm still here for this game day one. You already know what it is. Let me know what you guys thought of this trailer. Because overall, pretty positive, man. I didn't see any bad comments, to be honest. It's got 10,000 likes. It's got 2,000 dislikes. So, you know, the dislikes are still coming in. But that's expected, you know. That was a big controversy. It still is. But yeah, I'm hyped. Let me know what y'all think of this trailer. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.